everyone. Nice to see you. Today we're going to read a very special story called Say Please, Little Bear. And this is by Peter Bentley. And the beautiful illustrations are by Rob McPhillips. And I've brought along my own little bear here. Hello, Eleanor. How are you today? We're good, thank you. How are you? I'm very good, thank you. So, we're going to read a story. So, we'll pop you up there. Daddy Bear and Little Bear were on their way to play group. But Little Bear kept wandering off. He kept walking away over there. Keep hold of my hand, Little Bear, said Daddy Bear. Go gently, little bear, said Daddy Bear at playgroup. Gently. What does that word mean, gently? Mm, be careful. Don't be rough. <gasps> but little bear didn't listen. He's being very naughty. Little bear, it isn't nice to snatch. It's better when we share, little bear, said Daddy Bear. Later, Daddy Bear took Little Bear to Little Bunny's birthday party. <gasps> Who likes birthday parties? I do. And what do you have at birthday parties? Balloons. That's right. They went shopping on the way. Please hold my hand, little bear, said Daddy Bear wearily. What does that one mean? Wearily. Mmm, he was tired. <sighs> tired. Wearily. Toy shop. Then something in the shop window gave Daddy Bear an idea. Look, little bear, he said. Mouse wants to speak to us. Can you see the mouse? Well done. Squeak, squeak. There's the mouse. Mouse wants to come to the party too, little bear, said Daddy Bear. But he hates to be late. They reached Little Bunny's party on time. Mouse whispered in Daddy Bear's ear. Mouse says, 
Excuse me, please, said Daddy Bear. Little Bear ran to play on the train. Mouse whispered in Daddy Bear's ear again. Mouse says, can she have a ride on the train, please? <gasps> Little Bear snatched the popcorn from his friends. Mouse whispered in Daddy Bear's ear once again. Mouse says, would you like some popcorn, Bunny and Mole? When it was time to go, Little Bear stood silently on the doorstep. Silently? What does that mean? Silently. Shh. He stood quietly on the doorstep. Mouse says, Thank you for having me, said Daddy Bear. Little Bear looked at Mouse, then he looked at Daddy Bear, then he looked at Little Bunny's Mummy and said, And thank you for having me. Oh, thank you for coming, Little Bear, smiled Little Bunny's Mummy. You and Mouse can come and play any time. Mouse likes the way you said thank you, said Daddy Bear. And so do I. The story ends, the sharing begins. How lovely. Did you like that little bear? Yes, I did. I liked it. Oh, very good. Now we have these words up here. Gently, wearily, shh, silently. What do we call these types of words? Do you know? That's right, we call them adverbs. Can you say that? Adverbs. Very good. And they tell us how something is done. It told us how Little Bear stood on the step. He stood silently gives us more information. Great. Well, I hope you enjoyed today. And thanks for meeting Little Bear here. And I'm sure we'll see you again soon. Okay. Do you have anything to say, Little Bear? See ya. Okay. Bye-bye.